So we're here in Intro Week 2018 and today is the Sports Fair, so let's go check it out. So this is Dalchigan Centre where the Sports Fair is happening today. See it's very black and gold as we keep it with the varsity theme. We'll head up through. So essentially the sports fair is basically here for everyone who's just coming into the uni and second and third years to have a look at all the different sports that are on offer here, to join a team, to get involved and even try new sports that they would never ever think about joining before. So Archery, how can someone get involved with Archery this year? Well, there's several ways you get, several ways you get involved. Our flyers are all targeted towards the Give It A Goes that are run by the university. We'll be running them, but you can get them at the box office or online. They're £4 each and they're running on all these dates at half, from six to half eight. So we're here with Table Tennis. Uh, talk us about your sport. It seems quite simple, but is there like a more challenging side to it? So it probably is. Yeah, so we're very inclusive, so we can, anyone can have a go, we can get anyone in, and then once they progress, it goes up to a, like a really high level. So to get, to get in the, the, into the teams is very difficult, but as, an, as a social side, we've got so many social players come down, everyone can get involved, whatever, whatever if you're disabled, you can get involved, if you're international, you can get involved, everyone, everyone can come down and give it a go, yeah? Um, so tell us about the typical volleyball session and like how people can get involved. probably look at it and think basketball yeah what's the difference like uh, yeah it's kind of a you've got to look at it as a cross between basketball and netball so um, you can't bounce the ball and travel like in basketball but in netball um, you have to stand like one meter away from the person and um, wake up or you can get as close as you want can people get involved with your yoga sessions um, so all you have to do is buy your ticket from the SU website and just come along you can like the Facebook page as well, and all the information's on there. And how often do you meet? Like, how often do you hold the sessions? We have like four classes a week at least, at least plus events and socials as well. So parkour and free running. Um, how can someone get involved? Like, what's your typical session like? Okay, well normally we have like an hour, so we'll be focusing on like a core aspect of parkour, and then after that hour we'll move it on to more creative movement competitions. We'll have. Uh, a more free flow uh, way of doing things, but so the first hour is more structured yeah. and we teach them how to do it and then they can go on and do what they want to do really. So snowboarding, how can someone sign up to your committee and what kind of um, sessions do you do, like where do you train? Because obviously there's not that much snow in Sheffield. Uh, every fortnight we go over to Castleford in Leeds for an indoor session and we can learn freestyle, learn racing, we do trampolining freestyle sessions, get yourself on the Christmas trip because it's going to be mad as well. We've got socials all the time, just get yourself on board and we can sign up, obviously come up to the, st up to the stall here or sign up on Facebook and online. So, and what is the Facebook and online link? So just in case people aren't here today, like where can they find you? Search uh, Susk on Facebook, so S-U-S-C is the place to be. We have the Sheffield Bears, which is the ice hockey. Um, how can the student get involved if they want to like get on the team for ice hockey this year? Uh, this year we've got um, loads of different events and stuff that people can come down to. So right here now people are signed up to the Give It A Go and what you can do is you can come down to Give It A Go if you've never played before, the ice ring will provide the ice skates for you and will provide the sticks, gloves and etc and you can just have some fun. But if you've experienced hockey player and you've been playing for a couple years, there's also like we have trials, so if you, um, various trials for different levels. This is one of the hockey sticks, are they called hockey sticks, do they have an official name? Uh, they're called a hockey just stick. a hockey stick, hockey yeah. Stick. Uh, can you demonstrate like how you'd hold one, like how it goes? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, pick up stick. Stick, yeah. And then just, just here, unlike ice hockey, you can't use the back of the stick, so you've got to keep turning like this. Uh, yeah, as you can tell, my hands are pretty rapid, but. Thank you so much. Thank you. I spy with my little eyes, something beginning with. Coming down. How 
can someone get involved in your teams? Um, we've got taste, taste sessions on uh, Monday and Tuesday, uh, water polo and swimming both on Monday. Uh, swimming on Tuesday at Goodwin. Um, if you follow us on Facebook, Instagram, we'll be able to get you the details and logistics of the sessions. So that's the sports fair for another year. If you missed any of the stalls today, make sure you go online, check all their social media out and sign up and give it all a go.